Welcome to Thunder Show and the most beautiful moments of the past week. Today we're going to see some combat wit. Ain't that a frequent sight? A pest invasion and one of the most thrilling duels of this January. Let's get started. This tanker can't get a clear view of the target because there's a mound of dirt in the way. No biggie. One good shot from the Storm Tiger and you can get a good firing position. It's perfectly comfortable for observation. And for wreaking havoc among your enemies. Where we're going, we don't need dozers. If the point capture won't start and you see no enemies around, the reason might lie in a locust invasion. No kidding. Check the corners. Uh-huh, here they are. Three locusts cuddling between the containers. The recommended solution is cleansing with fire from a large caliber. What's stronger, a couple of 50 kilogram bombs dropped off a biplane or almost 190 tons of steel on tracks? Well, let's see. The tiny I-15 flies out of the ruins, almost touching a building with its wing, drops its simple load, and blows the mouse into the wind with an ammo rack explosion. The moral, always believe in yourself. After watching Thunder Show, you might think that the Storm Tiger is more impressive instead of efficient. Like, yeah, you can blow up multiple enemies with a single shot, but how often does it really happen? Well, Ashton surely does it a lot. They start with a careful triple strike, then proceed with a double frag, and another one. Three, two, one. Nice, isn't it? But Ashton keeps on pushing and takes away two more machines with another shot. All of this was done at an enormous range for the Storm Tiger, by the way. Props to you. How many tricky ways of downing a bomber have you seen? Probably a lot. But how about this one? The bomber pilot was so tired of fighting that they dropped a bomb and blew themselves up by shooting at it. Jokes aside, Kakmanen did a really good job here. One of the best duels we've seen lately. And now, as is tradition, we'll check out live War Thunder. Here's an amazing historical camo for the Typhon, or we mean the Sturm type. You heard us right, it's a historical skit. Granted, this kind of vehicle is going to be used in around uh, 40,000 years, give or take. We wish it was green, though, with 18 printed on it, some flames, and a white dragon head. But this one's good, too. A friendly reminder, we only accept replays from random battles. There's a lot of cool stuff you can pull off in custom battles, of course, but we're focusing on real high-stakes fights here. Looking forward to your random battle replays. Bye!